It's good to have everyone back. Welcome back to class. The very first thing I'd like you to do is to write out your fives all the way up to 100. So you're counting by fives, 5, 10, 15, all the way up to 100. So go ahead and get your marker or your pencil ready. I'm going to give you a minute. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job. Let's count by fives. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Let's do that one more time as I erase it. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Nice job, everybody. The very next thing I'd like you to do is to write out your numbers counting by tens all the way to 100. 10, 20, 30. Okay, I'm going to give you 30 seconds. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job. Here we go. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Let's do that again as I erase it. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Nice job. Next, I'd like you to write your numbers backward from 20 all the way to 0. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job. Here we go. Let's count backwards. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Nice job. Let's do that one more time as I erase it. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Nice job, everybody. Next, I'd like you to write out your twos. Count, skip counting to 24. Two, four, six. I'm going to give you 30 seconds. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job. Here we go. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Let's count that one more time as I erase it. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Nice job, everybody. All right. I'm going to write some numbers up. I'd like you to copy them. Let's go back to the first one. Can you read this number? 
173. Can you read this number? 104. Can you read this number? 130. Nice job. I'm going to give you 30 seconds to write them all in expanded form. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job, here we go, this is 173. So we have 100 plus 70 plus three. This one is 104, so we'll just have 100 plus four. Where there's a zero, we don't have to put anything in our expanded form. Here is gonna be 100 plus 30. Again, we don't have to put anything for the zero. Go ahead and check your work. And then I'm going to count by twos as I erase. Here we go. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Nice job. All right, the next thing we're going to do is going to be our addition. So I'm going to put up three problems. 48 plus 99. We have 64 plus 73, and finally, we have 29 plus 69. All right, go ahead and copy those down, and I'm gonna give you a minute to go ahead and answer those. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job. Circle a big number, which is 9, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 17 is a two-digit number, so I'll put down my 7. I'll borrow, sorry, I'll regroup and carry my 1. Here I'm going to circle my 9, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So my answer is 147. Nice job. Here I'm going to circle my 4, 4, 5, 6, 7. Here I'll circle my 7, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Nice job, 137. We did not regroup or carry a 1 because 4 plus 3 is 7. So there's no 1 to carry over, okay? Here we have 9 plus 9. When the numbers are the same, you circle the one on top. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 is a two-digit number, so you put down your 8. We'll carry over our 1, circle our 6, 6, 7, 8, 9. Our answer is 98. Nice job, everybody. Go ahead and take a second to check your work, and then I'm going to erase my board, and as I do, I'll count by twos. So I'd like you to join me. Here we go. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Nice job, everybody. Now we're going to be doing our subtraction. So if you would, please copy these down. We have 80 minus 17. We have 79 
minus 39 and we have 62 minus 28. Don't forget to circle the big number and if the big number is on the bottom you have to borrow. I'm going to give you a minute to answer those. On your mark, get set, go. Nice job, here we go. Zero and seven. Seven is the large number, so I have to borrow. The big number's on the bottom, so I have to borrow. Big bottom borrow. So I'm gonna put a one in front of the zero to make it a 10. I'm gonna cross off my eight and make it a seven. And then I'm gonna count backwards. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. My answer is three. Nice job. Next, I'm going to circle my 7 because it's the larger number, 7, 6. My answer is 63. Here, 9 and 9 are the same, so you circle the one on top. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. 9 minus 9 is 0. Here, I'm going to circle the 7, 7, 6, 5, 4. My answer is 40. Here, I'm going to circle the 8 because it's the big number. The big number is on the bottom, so I have to borrow. Big bottom borrow. I'm gonna put a one in front of the two. I'm gonna cross off my six and make it a five. And I'm gonna count backwards. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. Here I'm gonna circle my five, count backwards. Five, four, three. The answer is 34. Go ahead and check your work. See what you got right, see what you got wrong, and if you made a mistake, see if you can figure out what it is, because that's how we learn. Please count by twos as I do. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Nice job. The very next thing we're gonna do is draw some shapes. The first shape I'd like you to draw is a star. I'm going to draw mine really slowly to remind you how to do it. Because remember, a star is one of the trickiest ones to do. Nice job. The next one I'd like you to draw is a trapezoid. A trapezoid has a flat top and a flat bottom that's a little bit longer. And then we connect the sides that slant. It looks like a triangle with its top cut off. Because if we were to finish it, you don't have to draw the dotted lines, but it's almost like a triangle with the top cut off. Nice job. Finally, I'd like you to draw a pentagon. Remember, a pentagon looks like home plate in baseball. It's got five sides and five vertices. Nice job, everybody. We're going to switch over now to our coins. Let's sing our song. A penny's worth one cent, a nickel's worth five, a dime's worth ten cents, a quarter's twenty-five. A penny's worth one cent, a nickel's worth five, a dime's worth ten cents, a quarter twenty-five. What's this coin right here called, and how much is it worth? This is a quarter. It's worth twenty-five. Nice job. What is this right here? This is a dime, it's worth 10 cents. Well done. What is this right here? And how much is it worth? This is a nickel, it's worth five. Well done. And finally, what is this coin called and how much is it worth? Yes, this is a penny and it's worth one cent. Thank you so much for your attention today, everybody. I'm so proud of how hard you keep working. Don't forget that there's extra work available after the video. 
You have a good rest of your day, and we'll see you next time. Thank you.